Pastor, out of Washington, D.C. is calling on all Christians and pastors to live a minimalist, minimalist lifestyle. It's called the Jesus Challenge, and he hopes this challenge will go viral. Fox Carolina's Jennifer Phillips has been looking into this today. She's live in Greenville County with more on how this challenge works. Jen? Yeah, Cody, so this challenge starts on May 1st, and it's a year-long challenge, and the pastor behind the idea says he took the challenge a couple of years ago. Pastor Jomo Johnson with the House Church for Black Men and Families has a challenge. If we want a fulfilled and happy life, it actually is in giving that we receive. And so again, Jesus, he taught this. It's the Jesus Challenge, and he's calling on all pastors and Christians to live a more minimalist lifestyle for at least a year. Well, you can make the choice to give up one possession per month, one possession per week, or if a person wants to go to the extreme, they want to, we want to challenge them to give up one possession per day. He also says donate those items and record your experiences and giving. This 365 day challenge is really a call by which we kind of can detach from some of the material things. And so in 2017, I made the choice that I was going to really downsize a lot of my possessions, car, clothes. We asked Dr. Donnie Mathis about a minimalistic lifestyle and how it relates to Jesus and to scripture. If you wanted to boil it down uh, to a minimal kind of thing, it's a matter of the heart. Dr. Mathis teaches the New Testament at North Greenville University and says wealth can be used for evil or for good. So whether your life is, is a life of poverty or a life of wealth, that, that there's a recognition that God is the owner of all things, that God is the king of all things, and the, the one that we are to pursue is God himself. Jesus was not a man of great wealth. He says God wants us to be content with what we have. Pastor Jomo Johnson realizes the Jesus challenge is a challenge, but one he says will bring an invaluable gift of less is more. So Professor Math is here at North Greenville University. He says that Jesus did not live a life of wealth and so God does not want us to be greedy. Now if you are interested in participating in the Jesus Challenge, then Pastor Johnson wants you to sign up for more information. He wants you to register. To do that you can log on to the website. That address is blackmen.church. Live in Greenville County, Jennifer Phillips, Fox Carolina, the 5 o'clock news.